Hi, so today I'm going to teach you how to use states in Replo. Um, so states allows you to give different, um, the same container different styles based on some um, condition affecting the page. So for example, like a click or a hover effect. Um, so say I want, um, you know, this text to be, to change colors um, when I hover on it. Um, so I can select any of these containers that contains this text, but I'm going to um, select um, this header here and say, um, okay, so um, add a state on hover. Um, and on hover, now I can change the styling of this however I want. So anything inside of this, I can change the style of. Um, so for example, here, uh, I'm going to make this, uh, for example, um, the color red. Um, and you see here how it's only a, it's currently affecting the hover state. Um, and now if I switch back to default, um, it's still um, going to be on, um, um, if I go back here and switch to default, it's still going to be on uh, a black. Um, and then when I go to hover, it's going to be red. Uh, maybe I might also make this image a little bit smaller. So I can, um, for example, um, on the hover effect, I have to go back to the parent and then go to the hover effect. And then, um, for example, make this um, a little bit smaller, um, but I'm still going to um, center it. And now when I um, go here, go switch back to default, hover, default. Um, and then I can also animate the transitions between them. So if I do this, um, it will animate. And then now when I go into preview, um, you can see when I hover, there's a different uh, different appearance for, for these um, for this component. Um, hopefully that was helpful. If you have any questions, just reach out to us at support at Thanks.